Well, Bonefish Grill wants to give you some new ideas for fall flavors. Yes, Chef Andy G Granger. Close enough. G close yep. enough. Okay, <laughs> How, so make sure I'm saying it right. Ganger. Ganger. Okay, got it. Ganger. <laughs> Joining us now uh, with a couple of ideas to spice up your dinners during this time of the year. And uh, fall is more than just food. It's a, it's a state of mind when you're talking about cooking. And the weather's finally act, starting to act like fall it's as well. It's going to get so, you where you need to yeah, be. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. But this is, our, this is a part of our fall specials mix, which is always the most popular specials mix that we do. So up front, we just we have a swordfish with pumpkin Pump, ravioli. Pumpkin, talk, talk to me about pumpkin ravioli. Well, anything stuffed in ravioli is pretty pretty solid. I, this I'm, is just yes. kind of it's argue. just a sweet pumpkin spice that's on, that's in the center of it. We've done it for four or five years now, and it's yeah. always a crazy seller at the so restaurant. Must be doing something right. If Ab coming absolutely, back. we put a little feta cheese and Ooh. some crispy onions on top. So I like that. I bet that's a good explosion of flavor. You can do the pumpkin ravioli on the side as well. So a lot of people will put it with any dish that they order on the menu. Yeah, so that's an option. And then we have a couple other. Um, I always bring a martini. So we brought a fresh apple martini. It's a fall honey crisp apple. So the way that we do the infusion, you can do it easily. Yeah, at I was going to say, break, because it sounds like something that you could do, one could do yeah. pretty easily. My friends ha have me do this at home quite often, actually. Yeah. But all you do, you just take a vodka preference. Uh, so we put three bottles in, then you put some Domaine de Canton, it's a ginger liquor. Okay. And then you just cut up about eight or nine apples and throw some cinnamon sticks in it, let it sit for three days. And when you're done, you strain all that off. The apples actually taste pretty good after you strain them off as well. <laughs> um, and then and you have a third or fourth apple yeah. tastes even better. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. Should we make one up real quick? Yeah. <laughs> all right, so you put a couple ounces into okay. a shaker tin, okay. nice, nice and easy, after a three-day marinade, by the way. And then you make a honey simple syrup. It's just equal parts hot water and, and fresh honey, oh, okay. which That's gives you enough. just a nice honey simple syrup. Yeah. And then a little bit of fresh apple juice. All you don't right. use the you don't use the, the shot, you just you you got it by the eye, right? It's a count method. Oh, it's a count, <laughs> okay. And then we shake it up. Not stirred. Uh, no, no. We do have a new Manhattan at Bonefish Grill that we do stir. Oh yeah? Wow. That's for another day. I like a Manhattan, <laughs> okay. You come see me when you get yeah, that Manhattan, absolutely. Right? And then we top this off. This literally tastes like apple pie in a, wow. in a glass. And then we that's just top it off dangerous. with just a touch of fresh cinnamon. Wow. Cinnamon, cinnamon, don't forget yep. the cinnamon. All right, now can, can we finish up with something that he is very excited about? Absolutely. Okay. Pumpkin creme brulee, and we got a little bit of sugar in the raw on top, okay. but we do need to torch it off just to kind of put a little uh, oh boy. caramelization His right on the top. His story was on so fire safety today. It. So this just is going to be push push this? Just push it in. Oh, pull okay. it. Can you guys see this? Oh boy. Hit it oh. hard. There you go. Oh. Now, back and Look forth. Look at that. Look at that. Now you're going to want to make sure, as I told you earlier, if you have a uh, have a fire evacuation plan <laughs> with your family in the event. That How's is that perfect. Work? That's perfect. Perfect. Yep. Just caramelizes, gives it a nice crisp on top. See how crisp on top. Wow. Yeah. And then all we do with this one is just top it with a little bit of fresh whipped cream. And if you guys, this this one's my favorite one of the year. We do a chocolate one around the holidays. Yeah. This is this is pumpkin pie creme brulee form. All right. So if you want to give that a shot. Should we, should we give it a shot? Yeah, we yeah. have two all we right. have two spoons. Two spoons. If you should I give this it. back to you? Yeah, I'll probably it's take probably, that. Hey, all right. We're going to need we? that later. Wait till you try that. All okay, right. get, get yourself some. There you go. A little bit of that. Do all it. right, Bonefish Grill fall menu. Get some apples, throw it in with some vodka. You can do it all. All right. <laughs> Andy, good to see you. Oh good, good to see you guys as well. Woo! No, I have to stuff like that. Uh-huh.